Syntopia, I take care of unicorns a lot. So I thought, hey, maybe I can do the same in my world. Minus the unicorns. Grandpa Renza knew someone, who knew someone, who knew someone, and the next thing I knew, I had an internship at a veterinary clinic. If nothing else, at least this place is quiet and calm. Boarding school is always chaos. Staying here should be a nice change of pace. Are you Mia? Uh, yes, yes. I'm Dr. Romato. You can call me Karina. But call me that in the car, okay? Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go! Be better than the last assistant? We'll have to see, won't we? So, Mona's no better. Worse. She's coughing all day and night now. It's because you're not giving her the medicine I gave you. I'm giving it to her. She just isn't taking it. You give it to her with honey, maybe. Or apples? Well, you've got the right idea, but Mona needs medicine three times a day. And three apples is way too much sugar for her. So, it would solve the cough problem, cause a lot of others. Oh, man. So, what are we supposed to do? Well, we're just gonna have to syringe it straight into her mouth. You know that scares her. Oh, shh, Mona, it's okay. Well, it doesn't thrill me either. <laughs> Maybe I could take her out for a walk while you get ready? <laughs> Calm her down a bit. Mona, she's... She's a bit of a grouch. Don't worry, I'm... I'm good with horses, really. I got this. All right, Mia. You do that. Come. Don't worry. You're just trying to help. What's it gonna take for you to get this medicine, huh? <laughs> If you were a unicorn, I might have understood that. Speaking of unicorns... You wait here. I will be right back. Promise. not, she was. What he knows not, she does.
child. <laughs> I've missed you too. Let's go find Yuko and Mo. They're at the beach? <laughs> Why aren't we at the beach too? Let's go. <laughs> some weird stuff lately. My father wants to know why, so we're measuring them. Whoops. Sorry. <laughs> Hi, Mia. We're using my tide meter. It measures the tides with marble-like accuracy. <gasps> See how accurately that fell off? <laughs> Let me out a little more. Oh. Is there a new oracle? Anything about tides? Nope. Where he was not, she was. What he knows not, she does. Obviously, that's about me and Mo. I know lots of things he doesn't. Something's wrong. Careful, Fado. Hi, Fado. Hi, Mia. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you said the tides were weird. That's way more than weird. No worries, Aunt Chow. I'm fine. I've never seen the sea so far out. Can you even see the sea? I can barely see it. Guys, I think I found something. Ugh. What is it? I don't know, but it's stuck. There's no way it's coming out of there. <laughs> I loosened it for you. Weird. It almost looks like a stony pan flute? Impossible. Pans don't make flutes out of stone. What is a pan flute doing out here? It's not a pan flute. Look, there are runes on it. Could be some kind of pan language. It's not a pan flute. Um, there's a picture of pans on it. I told you, it's a pan flute. Let's see if it works. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds a bit sandy. Hmm? Do you guys hear that? Isn't it not me? <laughs> Earthquake? <laughs> Never, and I'm an expert on almost everything, especially pan stuff. Uh, that earthquake bent my throne. I can't get comfortable at all now. Stop with the throne and look at this, will you? Hmm, yes, could be pan. That's what I've said all along. Hmm. And isn't it strange that we found it in the ocean bottom? Yeah, I thought pans never lived near the ocean. Try swimming with these. Also, we hate getting water in our ears. 
Maybe if we can find out more about the flute, it can help us figure out the strange <gasps> tides and earthquakes. Stop being huh? so wobbly, huh? Hmm? An old flute? Explain earthquakes and tides? I don't see why. Well, I don't know why, but we gotta start somewhere and... It's the closest thing we've got to a clue, right? We could ask the Pan King. He might know something about it. That is a very good idea, Nia. Definitely worth a try. <coughs> oh, yes, do that. Let us know what you find out and so forth. <coughs> oh. This is not getting any better. I don't know how much more of this we can take. I sure hope the Pan King knows something. Whatever's happening, we'll figure it out. We always do, right? So right. Hand village ahead. Let's get some answers. That's the spirit. Uh, this is odd. Hello? Pans? Pan King, it's me, Fado. It's me, Fado, your favorite pan of all. I don't even hear any pan music. Isn't there always pan music? I don't like this at all. Pans don't leave without a good reason. The fire pit is still warm. They couldn't have left long ago. I wonder if they left because of the earthquakes. Yes, that's it. Pans hate quakes, especially the earth kind. Well, if they just left, then we can catch up. Let's go. You can't wait. You don't even know. Chow. Are you guys coming or what? They must have been hurrying. We pants usually move invisibly with no trace that we were ever there. Listen! Huh? We're close. Come on! <laughs> Well, I guess we found them. They are definitely going somewhere in a hurry. That's it. This way. Tiddle two. Carry on. That's my little honey crumpet. Fearless, steady, and great with directions. Lead on, sweet piffle. Pan King, greetings. Huh? Oh, elves. Where are you all going? To Bonobo Mountain. The Bonobo shall keep us safe from the ground shakes. <gasps> are getting worse. It means something, I tell you. Something not good. For one thing, they make thrones wobble. Yes, um, about that. We were wondering if you could look at this. It might have something to do with the ground shapes. <laughs> Keep it steady, for Bolobo's sake. Indeed, looks like an old pan flute with ancient pan runes. I knew it. Wonder if it still works. <laughs> Can you read the rune markings? Hmm, let me try. When unicorns uh, break, uh, partridge berry cake reaches uh, beaches. Huh? When unicorns break, partridge berry cake reaches the beaches? Are you sure that's what it says? Or partridge berry steak, cake or steak. Pretty sure it's one of those. Maybe it's a riddle. It mentions beaches, so... <gasps> Gotcha! Got it!
little fruit pie, honey bunch, honey bunch. Where are you hiding? The queen? She was right at the front of the caravan. Where has she gone? Please, my little berry bottom, say something. I'm here. <gasps> honey bunch. <laughs> There she is! My little muffin toes! I'm fine! But I'm stuck! I'm stuck! She's stuck! Don't worry! We'll get her out! Come on, Mo! Okay! He's not happy! We need to get her out of there! What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? <laughs> I'm, I'm... What? to have to hurry this up. But how? Ha! I got it! No. Where is that coming from? I don't know. Keep doing that. Keep doing what? Let me help! little pancake. You should thank them. Yeah. Some help you were. Oh, is that a pan flute? Where did you get it? We found it at the beach when the water dropped. <laughs> <gasps> what he knows not, she does. Pan Queen, do these runes make any sense to you? Hmm. Yes, but there's a part missing. But the shape of the flute reminds me of something I've seen before a long time ago when I was just a young pan looking for adventure in the Bulabo Caves. Watch your step. Oh, yes. Perhaps I should guide you. Don't need any more excitement Don't today. Don't see. Excitement is good. But, but you... Oh, my dear. That's not the first crevice I've fallen into. Where was it? Where was it? sense now? Oh, yes. Oh, yes, they do. When the heart of the eldest unicorn broke... You sure it doesn't say partridge berry? Shh. Shh. When the heart of the eldest <laughs> unicorn broke, so did the ground upon which it rode. It's talking about the ancient unicorn and the heart of Centopia. And the ground? That's the old Centopian continent. But when the heart is mended once more, the islands will return to their original shore. 
does that mean? When the heart of Syntopia was broken, that's when Syntopia broke apart into different islands. Yeah, and? And now that the heart has been put back together, Syntopia will, will come, come back, back together. together! That's what I was going to say. That's what the earthquakes and the tides mean. The whole Syntopian continent is coming back together. Whoa! Hmm. Sounds like space is about to get very interesting. <laughs> It's time for me to go. But you just got here. Uh, Let's not forget about this, my dear. You keep it. In case you have any more dragon neighbors. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll be back soon. Keep an eye on those tides. Will do. Bye, guys. Bye, Mia. Bye, Mia. Don't be long. Hey, you. What are you looking for? She's not going to like it. She doesn't have to like it. She just has to take it. She'll spit it out. Then we'll do it again. She can't have apples, Mia, remember? I know, but what about the peels? Peels? I've been around horses a lot and learned a few tricks. Apple peels smell and taste like apples, but they don't have as much sugar. So what if we give her the medicine with just the peels? <laughs> Sure, you put the medicine in there. A whole dose. Good job. Keep this one. I just might. <laughs> 